that corner. You can't slide it though. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, what's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. In this video, this is going to be the half slice guide to the Tallulah River Gorge here in Georgia. So it's me and two other guys from up in DC. They come down. We're all in half slices. For anybody that doesn't know this run, it's on the other side of where the Chatuga River is in Georgia. It's regulated. It's a highly regulated release. You got one way in these stairs here long stair walk down uh you little seal launch ramp it's a great half slice run creek boats and half slice well full slices too huh. and long boats let's just put it anything you can get down there it's pretty fun that's yeah the, that's another trail that comes in from the other side they don't allow anybody to cross over here big shout out to laura dillon and crew that organized the volunteer group that's the reason the um, georgia power has agreed to let us paddle this is because of those volunteers that kind of organize all this that does the waivers and everything you know so big shout out to Lori Dillon and, and crew that help out with this run every year I really appreciate that because this is one of my favorite runs this little canyon here kind of gives you that remote feel and you get to catch up with a lot of like boaters kind of end of the year run here November runs in April and November so that's your two chances of hitting this yeah. that one. Yeah, and you see, because we got an early start, dude, I've had to wait 45 minutes just to get down here, but we've been able to walk down. Yeah, fuck that. Doing, doing, we've got ahead of the crew. So this is the put-in right here. You want to go down and set your boat on the left to get it out of everybody's way. Woo-hoo-hoo! -hoo! I see this guy everywhere. <laughs> he's, he's the one that loves cowtails. I love my cowtails. Look at this. Get it, girl. get it, get it. Wrap it around your neck. See, come here. This is what happened. Ah, get a picture of that. Got, <laughs> see, it, it, it broke away. This, it's broken. See, this is what I was talking about. A guy that knows where to put it right there. It broke. It just, broke, you broke yeah, my cowtails. Just don't hang them up here. That was my biggest thing. That was Honestly, all I was talking about. when I watched your video, I was like, my biggest problem is there's not a fucking lot of air meter on I, I agree. <laughs> I know exactly. I like, what the fuck? <laughs> so this little area here is like a staging area where you're probably going to catch shit from people if you're me. But um, I like to come here and just kind of like take in the falls a little bit, do a little bit of light stretching, and get ready to go. Yeah. So we'll still launch there, reset there. I like the 360, that little rock there. On the left or right? See right there on the left? Oh, uh, yeah, right there. Yeah. And then we're going to cut that middle seam, and this is called last step. And believe it or not, it's it, where you see the water is exactly where you want to go. And kind it's of, right up and over that beer. Yep. Go a yeah. little bit left of it. If you go right of it, there's a little manky hole yeah. that can flip you, but nothing major. Yeah, so there, you see, there's not much warm up. No. You're, you get in and you're in. No, you get in, and that's the thing. You you still launch there, and you're just already in kind of a manky little class. I would say that's a class three plus. I wouldn't say it's hard, but no. it's manky. No. Yeah, you want to stay off that right wall, that little pocket. I watch oh, yeah. people get jangled up over there. But yeah, you guys ready? Yeah. Fuck yeah. Woo, the Steez flies. That's a new Steez also, ain't it? If you need help, probably yell at one of those guys. Corey will come down and help you. Oh, then I look like the mass beater. Oh, there's going to be more than just you having trouble putting a prana skirt on. You just want to kind of split those two. If you get sideways and get pinned, just kind of yeah. force hey. your way out. Yeah. 
Yeah, you just don't want to get on that wall over there. And you're good the whole way. Yeah, as long as you stay in that line, you don't have to worry about catching stroke. And we're in half slices, so we're going to get our tail caught. Good little play hole right here. You can do some 360s, but that's called last step. And this is our Tanner's launch or something like that. This isn't really worth scouting. You want to kind of, we're going to come in with a right hand angle. You're going to see a nub like that. Just right up on the nub, lift your knees. You'll see the rounded nub. Start going to the left. Little good little boost right there. Boost this little wedge. Then you want to hit this eddy here on the left. You can, you can scout it over here or portage it on the far right. You don't want to try to portage it over here. It's worth looking at. A lot of times I'll run it blind, but it's really worth looking at. That's it. So stay over here. Go a little bit left of that rooster tail and watch. Just hold on. I know. If you catch a skip, that's awesome, but there's yeah. also there's also a middle one that some people do. They go a little bit of that little flake yeah, there. Yeah, they, they yeah. angle this way. So it it breaks it down a little better for a lot of people. If you're not comfortable with this, I've run both. This is way better. Yeah. Yeah. And Trevor, the best advice for the bottom hole: if you don't get the skip and you do get worked in it, fight it for a little bit, and it might flush you. But if you just blow your gas tank, it's a big eddy, you're fine. If you get stuck on the left-hand wall, use your hands to start pushing back. Don't try to keep paddling. Okay, it's a real squirrely eddy. Okay. Keep facing to the left. So I want to go a little left of that rooster tail. You can kind of see it coming up. right there to work with but one thing I've found is there's some splats over here hidden I'm gonna splat that if you don't mind I'm gonna try to you got to get a run at it because there's no current
It's too shallow, I thought. shallow manky rocks it's not a hard rapid it's just like just manky top shit we're gonna work our way right to left right here. You wanna this is called zoom flume. off the left or right really hard. They call this doom flume. You can go middle but try to like boop off the rock. I screwed it up though because I thought so the line there's a boof line in the middle there's also a line over here that I like but it took my 360 there's a 360 right here Lint Rich I think what it's Lint Rich is that right yeah there's a little boof plate you'll see it's very obvious your bow up right there. Just hit all the eddies you 
can. Yeah, come on, man. Get you some of that hole. Working. That, that one's not fun to get worked in. Yeah. Theater, you can hike up and still launch that. Awesome. It's, it's just, it's just like you have to use ropes and that doesn't seem worth it. hit this hole up here. It's pretty decent. Man. We're head on down. Yeah, so Amphitheater has two really good surf waves in it. You can't splat it though. Oh, that's nice. There's a good boot to be had on the right. Try to, it, it's going to look like you're going to dry out on the rock, but just send it. So we're going to go down, kind of slow down, then cut back right. Can't really remember. This wrap is like double boot or something like that. I don't know. There's a boot right over here. You can play in that hole, by the way. You want to hit this corner plate. A little splat over here up on the left. Alright, follow me through this. We're going to go down, we're going to cut left, cut back right, and then we're going to stay center. There's a hole you got to punch. Yeah. Gonna go a left to right move here. I wanna splat that wall. Yeah. And then boost this hole. Woo! Here's the undercut move. I got the tip. That left wall is a really bad undercut. This is called tit and tat. You want to run this or you run run the center's the skip right out. Okay. Follow me, the skip. So you just come out of that hole and it, yeah. Just, just keep your bow up.
This rock is called Road to Entry. It's just going to be a bunch of... Oh, no, this is Tom's Brain Buster. We're going to go right and stay right, but if you need to go center, go center and split the rock. We're going to work our way down the right side. Tom's Brain Buster. I think you, it's hard to half splice that, but we can splice this. That's a hard one. This is road to entry. Tom's Brain Buster. It's a very manky rapid. That, that takes a lot of wood, doesn't it? It, it's right here on this corner. There you go. Oh, he's doing the load. Yeah, yeah, I don't think you're going to load that. Yeah. It's really, it's right here. Yeah. You just got to come up with a lot of speed. This is road to entry. A lot of slot holes, big booth at the bottom. Just, just follow me down for the booth. You want to stay to the left of this and split these two rocks here. If you bow up. Now there's going to be a series of holes. You're going to want to go through these holes, keep your bow up. There's some play boating right over there if you want it. Some play boating right there if you want it. See that rock? Left hand corner boot. I'm off one. I'm back on one. Um, I can't remember. Yeah, I forgot that 360 right there. Thanks for reminding me. I can't remember the name of this one. It's just down the, the right hand side. Not going to play spot here. You want to avoid that little hole and just work your way down this kind of center to the left. Cut back to the left behind this rock. I forgot about that 360 there. There was a 360 right back there. Boop this hole! There's a hole boop to be had right here. Yeah, this is called like left, right, or something like that. You can splat this wall over here. Not enough speed once you get Maybe. Wave, you know, it's small though. This is called Paddle Snake Ledge. Just follow me. We're gonna go right to left and then kind of ride it out.
Sister Terry. One of the best surf waves on the river right here. You can surf the top one into this eddy or blast back up and surf the top one, but the real one's right there. This way is really good. Double load it there. Same way right here. Powerhouse hole, catch a boof. Long boof, try to get like boof out. It's a sticky hole. If you get stuck in it, just fight it, it'll wash you out. If you want to sneak it, you would go far left. We're just going to boof right over the hole. Splat that corner. That's the end right here. This is the last rapid. Hit some of these flats. Just come in and ride the wall. I got stuck up in there upside down. Dude, it's brutal to get out of that if you get stuck in there. I just come up and let it ride. You can see the splat. Come out right here. Just load it. This is called Maxwell's Ledge. Just, there's really no line. We're gonna go down and cut, we'll go up there to the powerhouse. Normally I'd play them out, but there's a tree right there. The line is to go and there's a small booth off the left hand side down right here. Edition. Well, that's it. The boat ramp here at the end of the ramp. Uh, say, you want me to do a video review on your GoPro? That was, that was a full day. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Yeah, if you want to, what do you got? What do you got, Trevor? Uh, like, wait, didn't kill us five stars. No. <laughs> no swims. No clean swims. lines. Clean lines. We smoothed everything. Ocean was really sweet. Wade is the man at rescuing people from Ocean. How many rescues did you get today? Wade? I'm going to say maybe eight. Eight? eight swimmers that I pulled out of there. I threw my rope eight times. Twice I never even, I didn't even repack it. I just re-threw it. 